This is going to be a data-backed video, probably the most important video I've made in my series on how to get clients. We're talking about short-form vertical video, TikTok, YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels, holy macadamia nut, you don't wanna go anywhere. How's it going, Nez Nation? It's so good to see you. Thank you for joining me. If you don't know what I'm talking about, when I say vertical video, what I mean is vertical video is like this, right? It's shot, it's called nine by 16 aspect ratio versus most videos that you see on maybe YouTube, Facebook, Twitch, um, you know, even some of the Instagram square posts, they're shot like this, which is called 16 by nine aspect ratio. I don't wanna bother you with details, but essentially it's the difference between this, recording like this, and recording like this. Vertical video, this is normal kind of video that most creators, filmmakers, content creators really eat, sleep, and live by. But the truth of the matter is the statistics and data doesn't lie. TikTok has literally dropped the atomic bomb on all these platforms and the entire online marketing client acquisition ecosystem. TikTok has created an unbelievable culture. Why am I focusing on TikTok? Because YouTube Shorts is spawned as a reaction to TikTok. Instagram Reels was spawned as a reaction to TikTok. Check out some of these stats. 57% of video plays worldwide come from mobile devices. I bet you didn't know that, did you? I'm gonna get into some best tips and strategies and what you need to do to acquire clients using TikTok and all these other platforms that are very similar to TikTok. Make sure you stick around to the end because I'm gonna give you such a juicy tip that is just so beautiful, creamy, and delicious. Stick around to the end, you're gonna absolutely love it. I truly believe, having been in this ecosystem for almost two decades, that vertical video is not only the present, not only the future, but it's gonna be get even bigger and bigger and bigger. So how do you do it? How do you get clients on TikTok, Shorts, and Instagram Reels? Well, here's the deal. You have to understand the culture. You have to understand attention spans because in long-form videos, you have a lot more time to get your point across. You have a lot more time to develop and nurture those relationships. Again, the same principles, by the way, I'm gonna link those in the description down below, all those other videos, an entire series of how to get clients on LinkedIn, how to get clients on YouTube, how to get clients on social audio apps. I'm gonna leave them in the description and wait till the end screens at the end. I'll talk about them again there too. I'm gonna leave links over there as well. Short form vertical video is so different because it has to be 100X faster. You gotta get to your point faster you gotta really grab attention faster. If you lose them in the first two, three seconds, they're gone. Whereas with long form video, you have a little bit more time. So vertical video, it really comes down to one thing. You need to grab their attention a lot quicker and you need to be entertaining. You need to come up with really fascinating ways. If you think that you can pitch your company, your services, your products, just pitch them and say, hey, here's our products and services, you got another thing coming. You have to not only create that incentive, you have to not only create emotional storytelling, curiosity about your product, you not only have to solve problems, but I believe to truly be successful with vertical video, especially with TikTok, you gotta be entertaining, you gotta be fun, it's gotta have a very specific experience. In all of my videos that I've talked about in this How To Get Clients series, I keep talking about understanding the culture of LinkedIn, understanding the culture of YouTube, understanding the culture of Clubhouse, Green Room, Twitter Spaces. This is no different. TikTok is a very specific culture and experience. YouTube Shorts, the reason why I'm not focusing on YouTube Shorts and Instagram Reels is because literally they're just carbon copies, okay? So if you're successful on TikTok, I think a lot of people might disagree with me. I can't wait to see the comments. But I think if you're successful on TikTok, you're gonna see great success on Instagram Reels and you're gonna see great success on YouTube Shorts. And again, stick around because I've got something juicy for you. So it has to be entertaining. It has to be fun. It has to have a certain energy to it. It has to have a certain type of appeal to it. Communication has to be rapid fire. So the first thing I want you to do is I want you to go find five to 10 channels on TikTok related to your niche. So if you're a real estate agent, if you're a plumber, if you're a lawyer, if you're a, an accountant, whatever your, your services are, you're a cleaning company, I don't care, you're a, you're a, you own a pizza restaurant, go find five to 10 channels on TikTok, again, because this translates to shorts, 
It translates to reels as well. Go find five to 10 channels and I want you to watch. You need to do your market research. Watch those videos. Understand the experience and the culture. How are they accruing clients? How are they acquiring customers? What are they doing in their videos? The bottom line with vertical video, especially on TikTok, is understanding the culture. If you are not authentic and you try to game the system, you try to hack it, you try to gimmick it, you try to come up with some fast, quick, you know, shortcut scheme, you're gonna be found out. You're going to be left out to dry. Your TikTok, your short form video will be a waste of time, I promise you. One thing that is the big difference between TikTok and other platforms is TikTok is very, very tolerant of you know maybe not being the most Instagram pretty or YouTube appealing, just the raw, unfiltered realness. Brands and businesses need to adapt, which is why I keep saying the whole mission statement here at Nez Nation is bringing more humanness to this digitalness. You gotta be human. You gotta acquiesce to the platform. The platform cannot acquiesce to you. You need to acquiesce to the platform. So using music, using fun, humor, edutainment, if you will, bringing a very, very big type of storytelling atmosphere to your brand. That's going to, because the name of the game is, you need to bring awareness to who you are. So the way you're gonna bring awareness with short form video is being transparent, being raw, being real, being fun, not selling, not even talking about your business. I know this is gonna sound crazy, not even talking about your business. Don't talk about your business at all. Don't talk about what you do at all. You can do like, if you're a real estate agent, you can do, you know, stories about, gosh, you know, I was on this open house or man, I had this client, he was asking me these questions about, you know, you know, uh, uh, three things that I need to do before I put my house on the market. I'm like, dummy, this is what you gotta do. You can do things like that, real kind of fun, interesting storyteller type things. You can do things like that. But what's really gonna get people on TikTok is if you do, you know, something that really brings out those emotional triggers. Maybe a funny video about the five dumbest questions I get as a real estate agent. And then have a play action. Maybe your kids can be a part of it. Your dad, your husband or wife can be a part of it. And you do role play. Those kind of things on TikTok work really, really well. And again, it's gonna translate to YouTube Shorts. It's gonna also translate to Instagram Reels. Storytelling, fun, humor, energy, edutainment grabbing attention quickly. Don't worry about production. Don't worry about audio. Don't worry about lighting. Just be raw, unfiltered, and watch those other channels on TikTok that are doing it really, really well, that are getting tons and tons of views, because if they're getting tons and tons of views, they're probably accruing clients if they're a business account on TikTok, and don't copy them. Don't do exactly what they do, but take and be inspired by them. Take elements, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. You're a chef, you're using all the ingredients, a little bit of spice here, a little bit of paprika, a little bit of you know, uh, pepper, a little whatever. Take from all these places, be inspired. That's what you need to do. You know, you have opportunities on LinkedIn. People come to LinkedIn for very specific problems. People come to YouTube to really get their problems solved. Yes, they come for entertainment, but people who go to short form video like TikTok, shorts, and reels, they're not there to buy stuff. They will buy stuff, they will hire you, but they first, they're, they're coming there because they're just, they're interested in the phenomenon. They're interested in what's happening. They're interested in being entertained. They're interested in the experience. The more you know the experience, the more you understand the culture, the more able you are to communicate your vision, communicate your mission, communicate how you can help them, and the more you're going to get clients on TikTok, YouTube Shorts, and Instagram Reels. I promise you, I'm living proof of this. I hope you got a ton of value from this video. If you did, it would really mean the world to me. If you could smash that smash button, hit that like button, I would really, really appreciate it because it helps me. If you hit the like button, then YouTube and all these other platforms, they go, wow, people like this video and they push it out and that allows me to reach more people. And, and you know, share this out too, by the way. Share this with a, a coach, a consultant, a small business, somebody you know could get a ton of value. There's a little share button down there. Just click that share button, copy the link and share it with somebody. I promise you they're gonna get a ton of value from this because you got a ton of value from this and they're gonna appreciate you for sharing such awesome information with them. So it's a win-win for everybody. Share this out, I would really, really appreciate. Consider subscribing if you love the best information, the best content on how to grow your impact and your income online, whether you're trying to advance your career or grow your online business. 
this is the best channel. So you gotta click subscribe. I promised you if you stuck around this long, I've got something really powerful for you. So here's the ultimate. Here's the ultimate tip. What I consider to be the eighth wonder of the world is called the repurposing content. Here's the beautiful thing. I mentioned YouTube shorts. I mentioned Instagram reels. I mentioned TikTok. Nez, that's a lot of work. Like, shouldn't I just focus on TikTok? Shouldn't I just focus on one platform? I have to create videos for all three of these? No, no, you actually don't. This is what I think is the eighth wonder of the world. That's why I call it that, repurposing content. If you create the video natively, natively means you actually record the video. You don't take the video from Instagram, you don't take the video from TikTok and then post it somewhere else. You just record the video on whatever device you're on, whether it's Android or iPhone, record the actual vertical video. You can upload that same video to all the three platforms. Instagram Reels is now 60 seconds. YouTube Shorts is 60 seconds or less. TikTok now is three minutes or less. You can upload the same video to all three. It's called repurposing the content. Just maybe have a little more contextual copywriting for each platform, but holy macadamia nut, you can kill three birds with one stone. How beautiful is that? It's the same reason why I go live on Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, because I can reach more audiences with the same exact broadcast. I mean, repurposing content is the most amazing miracle. I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow up my microphone here. I'm gonna crash the set. I get too excited about this. That is the ultimate tip. Record it natively and repurpose it. Go check out these videos right here. These videos are the ones I was telling you about, how to get clients right here. Go check that out. The subscribe button is down there and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much.